Hey guys, it's your boy home with Ziggy and back here with another video. And today we're back here again with Dwayne the rapper and this is his What's Next remix to Drake's What's Next. And that and that's off of Drake's album Scary Hours 2. Now this really came out yesterday. Because uh, right now at the time of this recording it's literally 5 p.m. on the dot at the time of this recording. And like I said, he did he dropped this yesterday on March 6th. Today is March 7th. So and I'll be straight up honest with you. I wanted to drop it on that specific day, but the thing is I had my other video which took me so long to even post because my slow internet and all, which was my upchurch mud to go mud to go official music video if you haven't go check that out and it's like this whenever most whenever whether it's underground rappers or mainstream rappers do remixes to a popular song going on right now like or at least take a freestyle or so sometimes it pops sometimes it's not sometimes it's eh. most of the times it's just Trash or so, but, but but from 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 the rains, from the rains remix to NF's clouds, it was a banger. So trust me. And the thing is, I see like in his bio, so he's just a broke ass, and he's like this. He's just typical, even though his bio says. He's just a broke ass nigga from Ohio with eight kids and da 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 da. And I'm not trying to be rude or so, that's what his bias are, but sometimes it's like this. Even the underground rappers are so kind of like Duran, even them are the ones who make the lit, make the dopest music. So, and that's the type I like to see. So, we gotta check this video out. So, without further ado, Let's end video. I'm making a change today. Life is a book, it's my favorite page. Get to the money, let's pay for chase. Only thing that can take pain away. What's wrong with you? I'm about to cook up a song or two. Why you kick it at your barbecue? I'm working, trying to make God a loo. For the kids that I'm a father to. Yeah. I don't see too many niggas in this game that can go as hard as me. Nobody got as much hard as me. It ain't hard to see. I part to see with this artistry. Every time I drop something, I cause to see. On the microphone, I've never saw the beat. These niggas thinking they hard, they never saw the streets. I like how he does that, that little rhyming thing. Because it's like that inner rhyming thing I always talk about where the last word or so. You, you make sure to keep on rhyming it and so a for the kids that I'm a father to Yeah, I don't see too many niggas in this game that can go as hard as me Nobody got as much heart as me It ain't hard to see I put It ain't hard to see I part to see With this R to see Artistry Hard to see with this artistry Every time I drop something I cause a scene Cause a scene On the microphone I've never saw a defeat Just never saw a defeat Saw a defeat it basically, it's like your inner rhyming or so. Part to see with this artistry. Every time I drop something, I cause to see. On the microphone, I've never saw the beat. These niggas thinking they hard, they never saw the streets. You can never compare us, so don't resolve the beat. In other words, I'm a different breed. This rap shit is what I live and breathe. So turn your ignition keys and listen, please. Fuck school and intuition fees. I'm trying to make what a musician sees. I just want to make it so all of my kids can eat. Get my bitch a real ring from Tiffany's. And get us a crib where we can live in peace. My bank account's closed, too many deficiencies. I'm But I'm just saying, even if he say he's a broke ass nigga, how the hell can you fall that mic? <laughs> Cause I'm pretty sure with mics like these, they cost a lot of money. So I don't know if your bank account is close or not, but. If you say it is, it is. In other words, I'm a different breed. This rap shit is what I live and breathe. So turn your ignition keys and listen, please. Fuck school and intuition fees. I'm trying to make what a musician sees. I just want to make it so all of my kids can eat. Get my bitch a real ring from Tiffany's. And get us a crib where we can live in peace. My bank account's closed. Too many deficiencies. I already started from the bottom and I'm still here. But one day, like Kanye, I'ma touch the sky. I don't mm, But one day, like Kanye, I'ma touch the sky. <laughs> get, eat. get my bitch a real ring from Tiffany's. And get us a. And it's like this, people. I don't know why people are calling Kanye 
Jeez, Jesus, but that was Kanye who called him back. But okay, Kanye is just a weird individual to me. I mean, yes, he's successful and all, but there are many, there are many crazy moments in music in hip music history that's full with crazy Kanye moments. So trust me, the way how he is, hungry. it's just weird. He's just a weird individual. That's I'm just. That's all I'm just saying. Just in I just wanna make it so all of my kids get eat. Get my bitch a real ring from Tiffany's and get us a crib where we can live in peace. My bank accounts closed. Too many deficiencies. I already started from the bottom and I'm still here. But one day, like Kanye, I'ma touch the sky. I don't really need a record sign. Anybody fucking with the fam must be in a rush to die. I don't trust the soul in this game. They want fame to make them all the better. They love to lie. Shout out to them. Mm, they all. They want all. In a rush to die, I don't trust the soul in this game. They want fame to make them all look better. They may they love fame to make them all look better. They love to lie. Hey, it's like I say, most people who most rappers also be faking anything they say in their songs. Just forget the fame and such, so So sometimes it ain't all sometimes what they say. It ain't all true. Anybody fucking with the fam must be in a rush to die. I don't trust the soul in this game. They want fame to make them all the better. They love to lie. Shout out to the real niggas locked down in the pen who never folded and went and testified. These niggas be telling they're giving up all the folks. The pigs come, they be pointing them to all the dope. They Six nine. It and went and testified. These niggas be telling they be giving up all the folks. The pigs come, they be pointing them to all the dope. They really trying to make it so it's hard to grow. I hope all you fake niggas fall below. You get in some trouble, you the type to pick up the phone, ready to snitch and call for trouble. Who I just said a while ago. Six, nine. I hope all you fake niggas fall below. You get in some trouble, you the type to pick up the phone, ready to snitch and call for trouble. I hate the police so much that I turn off the TV when my kids watching Paw Patrol. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> and I've seen that. And that's a kid show for true, cause and I've watched that show. But with the way how so many police are nowadays, even the kids show version of police and so. Sometimes you just want to change it. Check Paw Patrol. I hate the police so much that I turn off the TV when my kids watching Paw Patrol. I'm making a change today. Life is a book, it's my favorite page. Get to the money, let's pay for chase. Only thing that can take pain away. What's wrong with you? I'm about to cook up a song or two. Why you kick it at your barbecue? I'm working, trying to make God a loop. For the kids that I'm a father to. Hey bro, that's basically the end of it. So it's like a shout out to Duran and hey. And the title What's Next? It's a could be it's like a cool little title because let's face it, people in the people whenever it comes to their life, they never know what's next for them. They just try to go. For me personally, I don't know what's next for me. I know I just normally go with the flow until when something comes up for me. I don't try to rush, I don't try to like rush in it or so because I know most people want to plan ahead and all but it's like this me personally I just go with the flow whatever comes no rushing it no try to stress me out or anything just make it go with the flow but hey shout out to Duran because that was that was cool and I think he's like I don't know why people always want to use our tool I always say if it if you know how to use it right and trust me he did but either way shout out to Duran great remix let's see if there's other remixes out there and such but for right now his his is bad his is just his is just that good but either way let me know what you think down in the comments below it's been your boy Humble Ziggy signing out stay positive and keep your vibes up let's go